Ja, ähm, of course, you both have already Sanskrit names, right? And these names, they are auspicious. They're not just ordinary names, they are names that are uh, given uh, with the blessing in mind, that whoever chose the name gave you, uh, wanted to give you a blessing. Uh, Vikash has different meanings. One meaning is one who makes progress. Another meaning of Vikash is one who is cheerful, yeah, which also fits. <laughs> I think so, doesn't it? But still I have to change the name so that you go into a, a new identity today. And uh, I'm thinking, well, my main purpose in this name is to uh, increase your focus on Krishna. Uh, therefore, I'm giving you a name that is more connected to Krishna. From this day on then, you will be known as Vran... Oh, I, before I do that... <laughs> <laughs> what are you promising? To which principles are you promising? For the rest of your life? Uh, okay, I, I bet meat eating, I want a little more specified. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Now, Prabhupada would always make the devotees say no fish or eggs, and you know, I mean, it, it is a relief when we have promised, then we cannot escape. All right, the rounds you already said, so then I'll give it to you. Uh, so, your name from this day on will be Vrajanath Das. <laughs> I have to come a little closer because my arm is only so short. Krishna <laughs> <laughs> can stretch his arm with that. Can. <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay, this time let's first do the, the, the vows and then we we'll talk about the name, otherwise I get confused again. <laughs> So what are the four regulated principles that you promise to follow for the rest of your life? Okay. Many of Very well. Thank you so much. Um, then, your name has been Sima. And I looked it up because I didn't know the meaning of the name Sima. But, uh, it shows in the dic dictionary that Sima means either boundaries, limits, or restrictions. Uh, 
which means that, that one accepts culture, which means the path of Dharma. Susima is a name which refers to uh, voluntarily taking the austerity of following the path of Dharma. So that is uh, the result of, of living such uh, a life is, is auspicious because one becomes purified. And therefore, uh, gradually, one becomes a saintly person. And therefore, I decided to give you a name which relates to that. From this day on, your name will be Sarumati Devidasi. Sadhumati, actually, um, I'm, I'm gonna, gonna, okay, one minute, I'm gonna explain it. Better sit down. When Maharaj Pariksit came to his mother, um, then he said, Gopinata uh, Prasadate, it is by the mercy of Gopinath, uh, that now you have become Sadhumati, a person who is uh, saintly in consciousness, or has a, uh, a saintly heart. Right? So, uh, Sadhumati means that, to, to be dedicated to being saintly. Not easy. It's like, uh, it's sort of a name you can uh, try to grow into that name for the rest of your life, right? because it's quite a quite a high high level, and in that way, such a name is is, is a great blessing um, to become such a saintly person. That, yeah, Rajan, that's what he looks in his paper to see what what's my name again. <laughs> <laughs> You'll get used to it. <laughs> it's like, in my case, my, my legal name is, is uh, well, it's Peacock, Paul Cock, right? And sometimes they write the, the, the last name first and this like that, and they never know which one is the last name or the first name, because Paul is also a last name for many people. So at the time of the initiation, they gave me a K, yeah? So I expected a P, yeah? So I was sort of waiting for a P, and then suddenly came a K. And then it was just, I always had a very short name, Paul Cock, it's my whole life, so it's such a short name. And then I got like, <laughs> So it, it was a shock at first, it was kind of a shock. But now I like it. So you have to grow into it, you know, so many years you had your name and suddenly, okay, here's your new name. Oh. <laughs> yeah. But actually these both names are really nice blessings. So I hope that uh, throughout your spiritual life you'll find uh, new inspiration in these names. And as, as I did actually from this name, Kadambakana, and now I know it's Kadambakana, it's like the forest of Kadamba flowers in Vrindavan, and it takes my mind to Vrindavan, so now I like it. <laughs> and then the mind, where the mind goes, we must go also. So when you have a name like Rajnath, how can you stay away from Vrindavan? And when he goes, you go also. Everything will be nice. Thank you. We'll turn it over to Gandhishwa who will do the hocus pocus. <laughs> you want the mic? No, you are very good. You want the mic? Please.
Sri Chaitanya Milo Vesham Sattam Vene Bhukhire Svam Rupa Kiramhaya Mdadati Svavadandikam Svaha Svaha Sandeham Sri Guru Sri Chatar Kamaram Sri Guru Dashtam Sharasaha Sri Rupam Sharvijatam Sahaganaraganatam Vitam Tam Sichiham Svaha Sarvaitam Sarvaitam Vrishnatetam Krishna Chaitanya Deham Svaha Sri Radha Krishna Vidam Sahagana Vita Sri Vishkan Vidam Shara Svaha Svaha Maam Vishnu Vita Krishna Vita Shumati Ramikana Swami Dhamade Svaha Thank you. 